listen more, I thought was very important as a boss and as an employee, you have to be listening to each other. I think a mistake a lot of people make is they don't listen and it, that's, how, that's when bad things end up happening. Character is a very important part of being a leader or even as an employee. It can be your biggest downfall or your biggest helping hand. Becoming a leader requires a lot of steps and these steps and you need to have a strategy in order to organize them. So first you have to start off with a plan and then you have to have a clear vision of what you want and what you want to achieve. Then you have to set goals in order to achieve that plan. Because one of the things about message and communication, you have to be positive. People don't, everybody thinks that people like a negative message, but they really don't. They want to hear positive things. They want to be optimistic. Failing is a crucial part of success. If you don't fail, you're actually not in the arena. To do well in life, professionally, personally, you need to stay energized and follow your curiosity and engagement despite what people tell you to do and what they think is right for you. Remember who you are and where you came from and take all the lessons you have learned and will be learning in the Solomon Leadership Program with you throughout your lives. Look at where you are and now think of where you want to be. Your vision of where you want to be is one of the greatest assets you have. A lot of people want to be excellent, but do you have the courage and, this, and the ability to sacrifice to pursue it. Uh, and you'll see people that are driven, and you'll see some that aren't, right? The driven people, will, you'll know, will achieve the cause and effect, right? They'll, they'll set those goals, and they won't stop until they attain those goals, right? Strategy is to find something you love and to try to learn as young as you can to believe in yourself. That's the strategy I have for you. We learn from Torah that what ultimately matters most is our adherence to moral values, not to the level of material success we achieve in this world. So when we think we're getting ahead by making judgments that are not moral, we're really hurting what really matters in the long run. So if a person really wants to be the best person they can be, stop looking at everybody else. Everyone makes mistakes, yeah, just like you make mistakes. A person should look at their own life and say, what am I doing? You need to have a foundation that your mind, your heart, your career, your family, whatever you're involved in, a foundation, a sacred place that's not touched.